My name is Mike Corey. I'm the president of Detroit Christoria High School. Welcome to our school. We're part of a network of 24 high schools across the United States. This is our fourth year in Detroit. It's our first year with seniors, and we're very pleased that every one of our seniors, all 46, are on track to graduate, but more importantly, each of them has been accepted to at least one college, and they've earned over $1.1 million in scholarships. My name is Sandra Garcia. I'm part of class of 2012, and I will be attending Madonna University for nursing in the fall. Each of our students work outside the school one day a week in a professional organization, such as a law firm, a hospital, a CPA office, over 85 different organizations. I chose the Detroit Christoria because I loved how it was going to be challenging like to go to work and to go to school. We're always pushed to strive for what we want and never to give up on anything and know where we're going and for our future. I'm Josh Martinez. I attend Detroit Crystal Ray and I'm a senior this year. Favorite subjects so far? I, I like uh, environmental studies. Right now it would be art. Since I participate in Night of the Arts, I'm really into like having an open mind about my imagination. They're all focused on getting a good high school education and being prepared to be successful in college. They work really hard both here at school and at their jobs and we're really proud of what they've accomplished. My experience at Crochet been, has been amazing. I loved it. I never thought high school would be like this. It's actually been a really good experience. I've been here three years and had my ups and downs, but I stuck it out and I enjoy coming here. I, I love the teachers, uh, pretty much everyone here that I, I got to meet. If I have the opportunity to tell people about our school, the one thing I say is come visit our school and see our students. Because when people do that, they're very surprised to see the students, their commitment to their education, their optimism about the future. When I think how far we've come as a school, how far our students have come as individuals, it makes me feel great. I think what is um, just a compelling narrative, in my opinion, is how young people enjoy learning. And I think a lot of times we, uh, as adults, hear about how poorly schools are doing and then we blame students. We say the students don't want to learn, they're not interested, and that's absolutely not true. When we put compelling information before them, they engage, they're thoughtful, uh, and they're excited about learning. Being at the Church of Street actually changed my perspective of life. I never actually planned on attending college. I was like, oh, I'll just stay home and just work with my family. But I actually want to go to college now, have a career, and have a set life. I guess I want more. I want to um, become somebody. I want to do something with myself. So that's, I guess, uh, work hard. You can, you can be someone. Cristo Ray is a school that works because a lot of people have gotten involved. Clearly the fact that the Skillman Foundation has gotten involved, the school wouldn't be here without them. We have over 85 organizations that hire our students that this year, through their job fees, will pay almost half of our operating expenses. We have individual donors who support us, and we have a wonderful staff of teachers and associates here. Without all of these people coming together, we couldn't have this school. 